What's next picture? I want to talk about the Xbox One Slim. Give you guys my opinion on this because I feel like you guys should really know this. So the Xbox Slim is going to be two ninety nine. It's going to be for the Xbox One. And, you know, honestly, I think it's not worth it. Um, they announced the Scorpio, so that comes out next year. Um, if you don't have an Xbox One and you only want to spend $300, then, yeah, of course, you go ahead and get the Xbox One Slim. If you into 4K video, like watching Netflix and stuff like that, then the 4K, then the Xbox Slim is probably for you. But if you're into gaming and you're really into virtual reality, I say wait because, honestly, you're going to want to buy the next Xbox One. Now, if you got money like that, be my guest, go ahead and buy whatever you want, but um, it makes a lot more sense to just wait and get this because, man, like, yeah, the Slim looks amazing. Don't get me wrong. I want one. I wouldn't even mind trading my Xbox One in to get an even smaller one that actually stands up. Um, I can stand my PS4 up. I'll save a lot of space. So you gotta, you kind of got to look at it that. If you want to save a lot of space right now, get the Xbox One Slim. If you don't really care and you've been using the Xbox One from day one, then what's the point of buying the Slim? Now, in a way, I feel like this is a slap in the face. I feel like Microsoft only made the Xbox One as big as it is just to come out with a Slim. So you can kind of look at it that way, too. Um, they kind of get more money out of you. But if you're going to buy the Slim and you only need one console in your house, trade in your, your fat Xbox One. You'll at least get like $100, $150 from GameStop um, unless you sell online for like 200 That's probably the smartest thing to do. But most people are just probably looking like, well, I might as well get the Slim. So if you can wait then go ahead and sell your Xbox One now. That's probably the best thing to do. Just go ahead and sell it now while you can. Uh, but, yeah, man, I honestly think the Xbox One Slim isn't even worth it if you're going to... If you're like me, you already have Xbox One and a PS4 and a PC, it makes more sense to wait for next year. So let me know comment below what you think about this. Let me know uh, if you guys plan on getting the Xbox One Scorpio. You know, a lot of these cool games coming out next year anyway, so you're not really missing a lot. But, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Just for me to do it real quick, let you guys know that it's totally not worth it. Uh, but let me know comment below what you guys think, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.